Welcome to Mark Bayerski YouTube channel. Listen, I'm making this um, video just to explain to you guys that the reason why I haven't been making videos is because next door there's uh, major work taking place. Um, and that work is basically uh, once was a beautiful little villa with lots of trees and gorgeousness out there is now basically uh, a construction site all the time okay now to be honest <clears throat> I can make videos I could make them and I'll make one now, but I'm just gonna give you an idea of, even with all the windows shut, how distracting it is for me to make a video with beautiful music on and this, this digging of earth and moving and concreting and, and smashing. And it's a difficult one, guys. And <clears throat> these guys do it all day, it's all day long. There's normally about 20 people there, normally. There's only about seven or eight now and they're doing different things so that it's a constant smash bang boom boom do 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 and so it's difficult and i really am sorry you could say to me find another location and to be fair i could find another location but my work is the academy so i'll show you my work right now this morning is with a group of uh, i don't know if you can see them or not can you see them? This is a, a group of beautiful green opal and a few other beautiful crystals. A few more here that I'm working on. Okay, that 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 consists my my day to day. That's just in one day. <laughs> okay, that, that, that doesn't stop. Once that's done today, I move on to the next batch. Um, since the last bo box opening I did with you, uh, I've managed to um, probably give away 150 of those crystals um, as gifts all over the world and the rest I put on my website um, let, me let me continue sh showing yeah I don't mind showing you uh, uh, oh no uh, here is the sage that I've just opened so I'm working on that sage right now Uh, I could have showed you all the other boxes of the teas that I'm working on. So my day consists of crystals, my day consists of working with teas, my day consists with the oils behind me, as you can see, I'm working on them as well. Um, so it's, it's difficult for me to go and find another location and do a video and then come back here, it disrupts everything and, and so it is quite difficult for me, and this work is going to be um, ongoing for, well, you, you can see it. I mean, it's been like that for nearly a year. Wow, the sea view is beautiful. So I've just washed my my, uh, my uh, bed sheets, but look, look at that view. Uh, if you can see in the sky, there isn't, let, let's go outside. There's not a chemtrail in the sky, which means it's a fresh, healthy day today free from toxins being poured over us. Look at that. Just take a look at that gorgeous sun. Look at that view. And yeah, I guess I'll, I'll show you again next door. I mean, literally a building site, guys. Building site. This was once a magnificent tree and they just chopped half of it down. It's really sad. And now all the wildlife's gone. It's heartbreaking, really. Heartbreaking, really is. But this is what, you know, this is like time to move on, I guess, in so many ways. Okay. So, um, you know, I get, I get messages all the time, okay? This is just a couple that I, I, I chose from, um, from work. And I get these messages daily, maybe 20, 30, 40 a day. And it's very difficult for me to answer all, all the questions. Um, like, let's have a look. So this person is writing for some advice um, regarding insomnia, which I believe was caused 
uh, by me working with Moldavite. Okay, around the head only for about five to 10 minutes. Uh, this is the second time Moldavite has caused my insomnia. Right. The first was about 18 months ago and took about four months to recover. So, really interesting topic and one which um, I feel is great to talk about. Uh, do I have experience of this? Yes, I do. Is that uh, credible? Absolutely. The person who was writing that was, was absolutely 100% honest and uh, truthful. And um, so, okay, it sounds loud, but let's, let's try and just see if we can talk about this topic. So, Moldavite. Okay, Moldavite. Moldavite, like anything in the world, works differently on, on each single human being. So first of all, if you hear that story, this, it's probably not point not 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 one percent of people who experience this particular phenomena. And the reason why that is, is not because of the Moldavite, it's because of what's happening inside your physical, emotional, and uh, mental state. And why that is, well, one of the reasons, and I can look back and at least see two people that went through that, and not just insomnia, but heightened of energy. So what Moldavite tends to do in many ways is heighten the energy that you, you are in and stimulates certain physical parts of the body to work, uh, awaken, and, and really sometimes detox, cleanse, clear. There's many different reasons why the Moldavite works in a specific way, but I think where I'm trying to go with this more than anything, and I wanna hit this right, I don't wanna make a mistake because <clears throat> so many people are gonna say different things about this, and this is why it's really difficult to touch upon. I, I mean, if I was dealing with you, I'd be on a one-to-one -one and I'd be able to tell you exactly what's going on and why. But on a wider scale, when we talk about this phenomena, it's because some things that were laying dormant inside you, both physically and emotional, Moldavite has this energy of awakening certain uh, aspects of the, um, I call attunement, the, the psychic, the, the men, many things uh, that you're awakened to in the psychic energy field. And a lot of my clients used to talk about a heightened energy when working with Moldavite. Now, heightened energy doesn't always mean positive. It can sometimes mean negative in the sense that you feel it negative. Now, of course, if you're suffering from insomnia, of course it's negative because you need to sleep. Uh, what happened to my clients when they came to me? Well, one specific client I remember who had this very similar energy effect, um, I said, well, are you awake most of the nights since you've worn Moldavite? Yes. Are you still wearing Moldavite? No. Okay, so there was an effect and a cause. Okay, so you took it off, yeah? And then it continued, right. Why don't you put the Moldavite back on and sleep with it through the night? So they tried it and within about a week, they were okay again. And what we came to the conclusion was that whatever was happening was trying to clear something. It got to a point where this happened and then they took it off and the actual full cleansing or the full detox, whether it was spiritually or physically, didn't uh, manifest as it should have done. So it was stuck part way. And with that, it can take time to resolve and, 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 and it takes longer. So I think what I'm saying is, if it was me and I started getting insomnia when wearing Moldavite, me knowing what I know now, I would keep the Moldavite on through the day and night and say to myself, whatever the Moldavite's doing, it's working in a way that is healing a certain something that 
needed to be healed. Now, sometimes we don't even know when wearing Moldavite, why we why we wear it. Sometimes we don't know what, what actually ever got healed. Sometimes we haven't a clue. But sometimes we look back on our lives, and as many of my clients said, and, and I definitely can say this, that I look back and say I'm a different person since wearing Moldavite. Different in what way? Well, I'm more aware of, of things in my life. I don't uh, allow things to sit deep in inside me as they used to do and cause pain and suffering. I have become stronger. Now, was that from the Moldavite? Well, I believe it was. I believe Moldavite definitely helped me along that part of the journey that many crystals didn't. Many crystals helped me with a connection of spirit world, helped me with, you know, grief, helped me with this, that, but Moldavite was more of a, 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 a seven sensor awakener so that I had the tools within me, what were always there, but they were working correctly now. So is the cause effect Moldavite to insomnia? It probably is. But I think that cause effect is because something profound is happening on, on a level that quite frankly, nobody can explain. I can't, but I, I, I can safely say this, after years of working with it, I look back and say, yeah, oh my God, the stuff that I went through with Moldavite wearing it, and it was profound but it wasn't always profoundly happy. It was profoundly challenging. So would I, if, I, if I know what I know now, would I, would I wear it uh, or leave it? I would wear it every time because it's done so much for my spiritual growth. So, uh, you know, yes, it does happen. And um, insomnia in many people, it can happen by an awakening, by being with somebody by having a healing session, by triggering something that you've eaten that you, you haven't eaten before, which is natural uh, food. And if you eat natural fruit or vegetables, it can sometimes trigger something that clears something away. And all of a sudden you think, oh my God, I, 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 you know, I've got insomnia. Sometimes there's something happen. I mean, if we start looking at that, what is insomnia? Okay, what is it? Could it be the fact that it's an overactive uh, mind? And because it's overactive, if you're wearing Moldavite, it's cleansing and clearing it and heightening that very thing that's happening. So all of a sudden now it becomes more, uh, you become more aware of it by way of not being able to sleep because it's more uh, active. But maybe if you've left it on, eventually whatever needed to be healed would have been healed and then it would be okay. I know it's a difficult one and why you're probably saying to me, why would I even want to put myself through that? Well, why would I uh, stick my head in the sand about what's going on in this world right now? Because one, I'm frightened and I don't, I don't feel as if I can conquer it. Well, that's the same with Moldavite. I'm gonna wear it and no matter what's gonna happen to me, I know I can conquer it and I know the outcome is the right thing to do. So that's why I wear Moldavite, wear it every day, have it on all the time. Um, and like I said, <laughs> the beginning of Moldavite is fascinating. It's incredible. But then again, you've got to understand from the point of view as a healer, I don't know what your, your spiritual essence is. I don't know who you are. I don't know what's going on in your body. I don't know what's going on in your, in your physical mind. So these things do happen. Has Moldavite ever killed anybody? No. Has it, any, has, has it ever made anybody commit suicide? Not to my knowledge. <laughs> I'd be more worried about going out on the streets with scallywags than a piece of Moldavite. Moldavite is a, is a cleanser, a clearer, an awakener. It, 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 it transforms your energetic field. It transforms your whole body, physical, emotionally, and mentally. It absolutely brings you to a different level. But to get there, it can be challenging, like anything. You wanna to get to the top of the mountain? Well, you know what, you have to climb it. But some people say, oh, I don't wanna do that. I'll just uh, take a helicopter. Okay, well, fine. But you won't feel the same. Won't feel the same. Might look nice, but it won't feel the same. If you climb that mountain and go through all that challenge and the, the sleepless nights like I did, like many people do, sleepless nights when you're working with crystals that energize and heighten your awareness, things are happening, guys. So, but I do get it. I get it. You know, you'll be shouting at the screen saying, well, you try and sleep. Yeah, you try and sleep. You try to get some sleep when you can't sleep with Moldavite. I get it. I meditated through them moments. 
give me a great chance to reflect. It happened to me, of course it did. Um, but I did a lot of um, astral travel. I did a lot of uh, beautiful work in, in that time when, you know, we were trying to sleep because meditation is, is a beautiful thing in their moments. But, you know, I, I, I get it. Some people just don't want to deal with that. And I guess at the end of the day, the choice is yours. It's really, really up to you. Uh, does that happen to everybody? Not point, not, 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 not one percent of of the population would would struggle with that. Would have that effect. So it's very rare, very rare. But I do, I do understand it, and I do get it. But f just to end on this note with Maldivite, I would, my opinion, from what I've seen over these years from all my clients wearing it, the ones that worked with it the best, the ones that had the most. Uh, uh, positive outcome outcome no matter what the journey was with it was the ones that wore it all the time kept it on day and night and uh, I did I kept it on day and night I realized that when I first started I took it off and I'm thinking I shouldn't have taken it off whatever it was doing I should have I know it wasn't feeling nice it wasn't good but keep it on keep it on mark and then I did, and I, I just, I mean, anybody who's ever been for a session with me, a healing, a one-to-one, -one, they'll tell you, keep it on, he said, keep it on. And I did, and, and I'm so grateful that I did because it took me to another place of, of healing, of love, of understanding, of awareness, of psychic attunement, of healing ability, many, many things. Cleansing, clearing, grief, suffering, abuse, uh, trauma. So it just goes on and on. So Moldavite to me is, is the, the crystal of crystals that definitely helps heal. So wear it, keep it on all the time. And if you suffer with it, then just say to yourself, this suffering is because Moldavite is clearing whatever needed to be cleared. So eventually it will be gone and I won't suffer that anymore. Uh, do I have sleepless nights? No, not anymore. Sleep really well. Um, like I said, as long as I eat healthy, if you're eating shit, then it's not, not my fault, it's your fault. If you're eating garbage, if you're eating sugar, then sell Aviv. That's your that's your issue. That's not the Moldavite. And um, what probably is happening is the Moldavite is trying to clear that uh, that crap from your body, and thus you know these things do happen. Anything can happen from there. So yeah, healthy body, healthy mind. Uh, exercise well. Eat fruit and vegetables, and don't go anywhere near toxins at all. Um, again, if you've uh, done, done the jib jabs, then that ha that could have a massive effect as well, guys. Massive effect to your physical in so many ways. So please try not to blame Maldivite. It's only doing its job and it does it well. And it's been doing it well for my thousands of clients over the years. So there you go. Noise, we got through it. I hope that helped. There's, there's a, a few more letters that I could talk about, but let's just stick with this today. Have a great day. Thank you so much for going to markbayeski.com. Yes, I uploaded another 130 crystals on my website, some beautiful rare ones. This one is just about to go up here. Gorgeous, gorgeous piece. That's topaz, fantastic, love it. And, uh, and a few others that are going up today as well. So hope you enjoy mattbyeski.com. Go and have a look. Enjoy yourself there just for the feel and the energy of it. Ha have a look at the shop. It might blow you away. Some beautiful stuff on there today. All right. I'm going to get some work done now. I wish you a beautiful day. Uh, so much happening in my life. And I'm very grateful for it. And I hope you are all feeling great. And I'm just about to drink uh, one of my teas which is the detox cleansing tea. And then about two hours later, I'll be drinking the parasite cleansing tea. Feeling great, I really am. <laughs> Get that tea down, you lass. Bye-bye. <laughs>